Lock up to my feet, hurt the slayer, yeah. yeah. Better yeah. off the worst, took the good, we can pay, yeah. yeah. I don't took a ride in the hell, come on, yeah. I don't took a hold down, where to kill me. Welcome back to another episode of Lit Podcast. You know what I'm saying? I got the fam in this bitch. Mm-mm. Hold up, y'all. It's been a minute, and I'm back. I'm doing it again. But uh, before I introduce my special guest, you know what I'm saying? You know how I do it. I bring you the hottest artist, the legendary artist, you know, the up-and-coming artist, you know what I'm saying, around the motherfucking Metroplex and everything in between. And today in the hot seat with me, man, I got my boy Six in the motherfucker building. What's going down, man? Wait, well, what's up, man? Shit. Say, man, I appreciate you coming out here fucking with me and shit. So uh, I know this your first time to the show. So I'm going to show you how we do this. We get lit. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to be passing some of these sticks around. We're going to get blowed. We're going to get ready to talk about this motherfucking road and this journey that you on. And um, hopefully, you know what I'm saying, we can get some people tuned in. So, um, oh, bullshit. so for the people out there that don't know you, please let them know who you are and where you from. Shit, my name's Six. I'm from Dallas, Texas. Shit, you know, stay down gang. Shit, oh, stay yeah, down gang. Yeah, that's my gang, you know. It ain't, it ain't too many of us, ain't too many like us, you know. I ain't, I ain't gonna say too much, but you already know so, what's going on. So where you from at the D? I'm from Pleasant Grove. Okay, Grove side, you know what I'm saying, that greedy part, you know what I'm saying? The six five, you know what I'm saying, to be okay. correct. Yeah, okay, so man, so like... For the people who don't know that what brings you here, man, I see you got a journey of doing music. What, what inspired you, what... what What's that in your mind? Like, hey, man, I'm finna start doing music. Here you go. Uh, what inspired you? Who inspired you? Uh, shit, I ain't gonna lie. Um, the people around, like, that I just seen growing up doing music. Like, number seven, he inspired me. Like, cause, just because he from the hood. Who else, shit? I am woke up, you know, grew up listening to Young Boy and shit, too. You know okay, Young Boy, yeah. So he kind of made, like, that drill shit cool, and then that's what a nigga going through every day of life, you know, you know what I'm saying? Right. So being the, a young nigga. So drill music is your is your topic, that's your category, that's your sub genre? I wouldn't say that's my sub genre, because, you know, a nigga trying to get rich, I ain't trying to have, you know what I'm saying? You know what right, saying? I ain't right. trying to have options, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I want my face car good. Right. You know what I'm saying? But this shit got to be just fuck about in the songs, you know how they go. Mm-hmm. Shit. So do you know any OGs from the Grove? You remember NFL boys? Do you, you know Damn D? Do you know like you know? <laughs> I know of course you know uh, Fat B, uh, you know Tum Tum. Uh, what about Boonky? You know what I'm talking about? <coughs> yeah, I know a couple of them. <coughs> I know like some like 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 ten for instance. <coughs> that was one of my that was one of my big brothers. You know what I'm saying? I still fought them long the ten. Long live uh, 10. That's your brother, right? That's yeah, what you talking about. Yeah, that's my bro. You know what I'm saying? That ain't my blood, but you know, loyalty. That's between the family. You right. Know, you know how that go. Right. The man, like we was talking about that before we even got on the mic, the stretch game. Stretch game was something to reckon with back in the day. Like you say, yeah. seven, number seven was inspiring you. You know what I'm saying? Like, what, what, when did you pick up that pen in between that time? You know what I'm saying? And what was it like when your brother passed away? See, when 10 passed away, at first, at first, like shit, I was just trying to be on my nigga side while everybody grieving, cause I know that shit, that shit really, really fucked up to lose your blood. You know what I'm saying? Right. You know what I'm saying? And I fell for it, even though it was in my blood, so that shit fucked me up too. So shit, I really just picked up the pen. Um, I really didn't want to pick no, up no pen. Look, I was freestyle. I just always been the type of nigga to just freestyle. You already right. know, I'm with my brother and shit. We always getting hot. <laughs> so I'm just freestyling. And nigga t- say, "Hey, nigga, in the studio." I say, nah, I'm cool. I, I ain't no rapper that nigga. He say, hey, right. fam, get in the studio. You got some, no bullshit. So, shit, just this year, you know what I'm saying? I just not start trying to take it serious a little bit. Oh, so now just this year you taking it serious, man. You done dropped a lot of material within just this year. You know what I'm right. saying? Like, now nah, for real, for real. So what is it? So how has it been, you know what I'm saying, since you've been rapping? Like, what's, what's, um, what you been learning, what you been coming across? What I've been coming across is, you know, don't let the, first of all, that rabbit shit, don't let what everybody else is doing to blow, you know what I'm saying, trigger you to do that shit. You know what right, I'm saying? Right. Like the like it's a whole it's a, it's a real life strategy in this shit, you know what I'm saying? Nigga ain't trying to get in this shit, die, you know what I'm saying? Have to do all the bullshit, you know what I'm saying? Keep on watching all this shit, shoulder and shit. Nigga trying to get rich, I'm trying to get paid. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? So 
I'm trying to do this shit the right way, stay out of jail. You know what I'm saying? I'm fighting cases and shit already as it is. God damn, shit. It's always, every time somebody come on the platform, they fighting cases. You know what I'm saying? Free my nigga Tarzan. Shout out Tarzan, nigga. Ooh, no, ooh, ah, ah, free 30, ah, motherfucker, nigga. shit. Free 30, no bullshit. <laughs> nah, for real. So, like, man, how you hook up with Loon? Uh, shit. Uh... I really just not um, came back to down here for watch at you just cause like my family and shit from down here. You know what I'm saying? So I only been down here for like a year and a half. And then I found out I like shit. My mom was introducing me to my family and shit. I ran across Loon at the studio, I think I remember. And then me and him just locked in from since then shit. And that nigga just been loyal. He just been showing me the way with the music stuff. He been telling my ass, you know what I'm saying? Like, just post less of this, like fix this, so you know what I'm saying? And he always got my back with the shit too. Right. You know what I'm saying? So I look at him like family, like his decision must definitely matter. Even Duke too, you know what I'm saying? He don't mind of it. Right. They just, they just been helping me out. And it's still they like it's they don't try to control or do nothing extra. Like, but they tell me and help me like, hey, if you're gonna be stay down, make sure you stay down the right way. You know what I'm saying? Right. Make sure your gang ain't going to jail. Like put them on money before you go put them on the league. Nah, you know for, real, for real, for real, for real. A lot of niggas, you know what I'm saying? They only your homeboy just so you can crash out. You know what I'm saying? Nigga ain't trying to, I don't want to see my partner behind no bar. Nah, no for bar, real. Nothing but nigga know how this street shit works though. You know what I'm saying? You got to get that GB shit, let that be. You know what I'm saying? Man, Catch it. With, you know what I'm saying? Don't look, go looking for none. Nigga, I said in a song a long time ago, nigga, I said nigga, streets can't hug you back, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Even though nigga got love for the streets, some streets can't hug you, nigga. Them streets can't, nigga, make sure you all right. You know what I'm saying? Like, fuck them streets. You know what I'm saying? Like, and fuck them, and fuck them damn, them, them jail bars, nigga. Like, nigga ain't trying to be around nigga nuts and butts all day. You know what I'm no saying? No bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Like, fuck that, nigga, shit. I'm trying to see something, nigga. I'm trying to see what the world can offer, but bullshit. I'm. that's good that you got, what can I say, like, Real man, you know what I'm saying? Cause that's what that, that's what real man is. That's see if a if a person can teach you something like that, that's that, that's a stand up in person. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. You know it ain't you know it ain't no play play. You know because another nigga can tell you real quick, nigga shit, nigga take this gun, nigga take this powder pack, nigga take this right here, nigga, nigga come holler back at me. You know what I'm saying? And then he already know you gonna lose out. So shit, nigga already in his mind, he 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 wanna offer you or fuck you or do you something bad because he already gave you a bad pack to start off with. Like bullshit. I don't but see see and this type of shit I be on, you know what I'm right, saying? Like, right. Even if we got a problem, if I got a problem with a nigga, it's probably cause it's in the, cause a nigga, you know what I'm saying, try to play with me or do something first. But most of the time I don't you know what I'm saying, I don't go look for no problems or nothing. Right. I be chilling. I'm the type of nigga like, I just wanna get paid with this shit. You know what I'm saying? Nigga real life ain't never had shit. So speaking of getting paid, do you have you been getting? Hell yeah, I be getting paid for features and shit. Already. Okay, oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? Like a couple of my people, they just ain't, they just don't be dropping this shit. Right. They be scared. It be like they first song and shit. They just be paying for features. But I be like shit, like, be like you know what I'm saying? Like they be saying some some type of shit. Like come on, let me be in stay down. You know what I'm saying? They be paying a little bit, but uh, okay. you know I just be like, hey fam, like stay down. Ain't no, you know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing. You can just join. Like these my niggas, I truly fuck with my right. nigga Dose and Uno. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to them, my brothers. Really, that's that's my really. game, you know what I'm saying? Oh, VZ too, you know what I'm saying? So, so you know how you know how serious it is when it's getting into the music business. Have you been? Matter of fact, have you been? You watch podcasts? Yeah. Have you, you watched Willie D? Oh uh, no, I haven't. Oh, you don't watch Willie D? Okay. Like well, Willie D right now he's he got a podcast going on right now with Lil Flip. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And Hunt from Sucker Free Records. I don't know if you remember that. I know that's a little bit before your time, but I know you know who Lil Flip is. Yeah. But anyway, they talking about business, paperwork and shit, and how people are taking publishing and writers and all that stuff like that. Like, and I'm asking you this is because a lot of cats get into the in- industry, and you know, and sometimes yeah, when we start, this is for fun because there's some shit that we love to do. But at the end of the day, when we know this can feed our family. We don't really take the business serious. We just, we just think think it's just cash over fist, or it's like it's loyalty. You my partner, so you just got me, and whatever you gonna do for me, you gonna do for me. Instead yeah. of learning the actual business, and what what steps right now are you taking to really like understand the business of the music? You know what I'm saying? Uh, shit. <clears throat> uh, to be honest, like I already know a little bit. Like when I was in school. And like I had already did my research, I was looking into like personal finance and stuff like that. You right. Know what I'm saying? So just so I can manage myself, cause I already know like I don't really, really like too much trust nobody. You know what I'm saying? Right. My money and the other side of my stuff. Right. But I've been trying to educate myself. You know what I'm saying? 
and slow down, stop moving so fast with the stuff. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I, that's just why I feel like I'm coming to me as I go. But I know like the decisions I make with the music shit, they gotta be like on point. Right. Cause I can get fucked over at any point of time. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, and I like I'd have been offered deals already. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like little chains though. You know what right. I'm saying? I had one big, big deal, but like I can't go to that just cause my feeling. Like, you know what right. I'm saying? Like, right. So what? So do you do you uh, copyright your music? No. Oh, what about ASCAP? You got ASCAP, BMI, CSAC? No. Do you, you got publishing? I got all my stuff. What you mean? I got publishing. I got my I own my own publishing. Oh, who you got publishing through? Uh, CD baby. Oh, okay. So they the oh, okay. So it's when you distribute it, yeah, they give you now. Nah, what you now? Nah, you need to get your you need to get your own though. You need to get like your personal P line number. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So you can start collecting your royalties from certain stuff. You know, I know even though you fuck with, even though if you will ask for BMI, a lot of people don't understand why they don't really see a lot of checks from that. It's because that's for radio play. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Or streaming sometimes, you know, depending <laughs> on what, or movies or whatever. But uh, you definitely want to probably start doing some copyrights of your music. You know what I'm saying? That's going to that's gonna help you solidify and really own your stuff. Um, ASCAP, BMI for sure, uh, yeah. but you want to get the MLC and Harry Fox, man. You want to publish your music. You want to publish your music, and then you want to make sure you're getting your mechanical royalties, your streaming royalties, everything like that. Like, what's your, what's your, like right now in your catalog, are you just dropping mixtapes, or are you dropping albums, or are you just dropping Look. singles? How how you working So right, right now, now, that's what I'm doing. So, um... And I just been dropping singles and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Just to get my name out there, get them to um, know who CC is. You know what I'm saying? Okay, cool. Different shit like that. Different shit like that. Trying to be a little versatile. Okay. So I'm gonna drop an EP. To, uh, you know what I'm saying? On the okay. 16th. Okay. 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 Uh, you know what I'm saying? All new shit. Nobody heard. You know what I'm saying? Okay. All right. So what? If, so right now, what's your avenues right now? What are you using? Uh, like IG. IG, Instagram. I'm just using uh, Instagram right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get Facebook and TikTok and stuff to go on. You know what I'm saying? Right now. Right. I got all this shit up. You know what I'm saying? Right. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Just so I can get more views on different shit like that. But that's all I got going right now. But Instagram for sure. Only one to stay down. Okay. What about we doing the shows? Nope. But yeah. I got some coming up. I got one on June 21st coming up. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. All right. All right. So, all right. So, you ready? Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm ready. Oh, you, sure. Yeah. You already look like you hype. You ready for it. You know I what I'm saying? Sure. Already, so like, what's like <clears throat> when you get your first taste of your store, you know you ain't looking back, right? You oh know, yeah, you gonna... like, <laughs> look, look, I'm trying to tell you, like, when I get my first show, like, I get my first bag for anything, right? This shit going up, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm so smart with it, like, I know I can't feel, like, right? I'm so nigga so scared to feel, like, and, and it's not even like I'm not, I don't even say it in a bad way, but I just know it ain't no if ends or buts right. about it. Right. You can't fumble, nigga. Right. You know but say, I'm gonna tell you something though. I'm, I'm glad you said that because you know a lot of people don't admit to their fears and stuff like that. And and as a man, or as being a, becoming a man, you gotta admit to something. You know what I'm saying? A bull. Hey, you know, but don't be afraid to fumble because you gonna learn something. You know what I'm saying? Like, like. I had to learn that, you know what I'm saying? I always wanted to be that, you know, that OJ Simpson, you know what I'm saying? Like that nigga was, nigga, that nigga was America's love boy, you know what I'm saying? Everybody loved that nigga. Yeah, he couldn't do wrong in nobody's eyes. You see that he murdered, uh, murdered a white girl, allegedly, my man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And got away with it, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Our real talk, you know what I'm saying? Bro, I just be, you know what I'm saying? But you learn from it, though. I don't know, you know what I'm saying? Like when, like when I went to jail, like, uh, I don't know, they really gave me a, like a kind of like a hard another experience like like you know what I'm saying like also still cause, cause like I told me like they kind of told me like you ain't gonna be able to see your family no more you know what I'm saying right like, I got a family to feed I got a son on the way you know what I'm saying yeah so like this is my first son so you know I ain't trying to go for that fuck the fucking crap you know they always yeah. they fuck always the they always they've been telling us that from the beginning of time you ain't gonna see your family I gotta <laughs> I gotta you know what I'm saying but look though I told them just like this I was like shit you know what. Guy do give a nigga warning before he give it, you know what I'm saying? He give a nigga destruction, you know what I'm saying? If you, right. a nigga just slow down and watch everything in front of me that go on, you know what right. I'm saying? It, you either got a choice. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, 
I got on from watching another nigga get on, you know what I'm saying, selling this. Right. You know what I'm saying? So I start selling that because I see it got on. Right. But I also seen it got on the jail. Right. Which path I'm going to choose, shit. Right. I'm either, shit, he got rich off of it or shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's shit, either or. We're not real spit. Because that's, what, be that's what it is in life. It's always that choice. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You either going to go left or you going to go right. You going to either take the blue pill or you going to take the red pill. Nah, <laughs> nah for real. Man, it's, the, I, it's the matrix. I can hurt as many niggas as I want when I get rich. Right. When I get, like, <laughs> as many as you niggas I don't fucking like shit. Yeah. When you get rich. Nah, for that's real. That's all you need, nah, man. enjoy your life now. I, I, nah, for real, young man. Enjoy your motherfucking life. Live it, you know what I'm saying, to the fullest because you only got one. You know what I'm saying? No real. Nah, for real. So, like, What's your next step? Like, what after you know? Because you know, music is a tool. What, what other aspirations, what other dreams, and, and or investments and stuff you want to do within uh, your journey? I'm gonna do clothing. You know what I'm saying? We okay. already, I already got the clothing brand conditioner going. You right. know what I'm saying? That stay down gang. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be on yeah, the my, stay down gang. For shit. sure, it's gonna be on some hoodies, some shorts, all that stuff like that. I know how to show too with my own hands, all that stuff like that. You right. Know what I'm saying? I know I got a couple of females around me that know how to do her, you know what I'm saying? A couple, you know what I'm saying, bros around me that know how to invest some stuff too. Right. Cut hair still like the everybody around me talented. All my partners right. talented, you know what I'm saying? Right. So you talking about putting people in position. Yeah, yeah. we gonna, you know what I'm saying? We all gonna eat, cause right. you know what I'm saying? Like we don't like asking each other for like the type of people we is, we don't even like asking each other for nothing. Right. We just, you know what I'm saying? If we see it, shit, we gonna Right, you got it. You know what I'm saying? Nah, for got real. Bliss. Now, who you listening to right now? What's what you on? Like, who you listening to in Dallas? Who you listen uh, to outside of Dallas? What's, what's going on out there? That, who I'm listening to? In, that, who I'm listening to in Dallas? Yeah, who uh, you listening to? I ain't gonna lie. Uh, shit, that nigga Spank hard. Spank. Spank? I fuck with Spank. Hey, okay, hey. where's Spank from? Spank from. I think he's from Oak Cliff. Okay, all right. Hey, that nigga hard. Um, FBG murder. Yeah, he going on. Uh, yeah, FBG, yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, look, I, I fuck with underdogs too. This nigga named Two One Four Lil Eric. Two One Four Lil Eric, okay. Yeah, he shit. hard too. You heard it first on Lit Pop. Yeah, y- y'all gonna be on the lookout for Two. What you say, Two One Four Eric? Yeah, Two One Four Lil Eric. Yeah. Uh, Future. Future. Okay. Yeah. All right. He one of my favorite rappers. Yeah, he just dropped that one with him and Lil Wayne. No bullshit. I'm fucking yeah, with Future. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And that, then, nah, that was Two Chain and Lil Wayne. Now Future just dropped one with uh. Uh, Metro Boomin wasn't it? Yeah, uh huh, yeah. yeah that's, that's what I was just gonna say. Yeah. But look though, that motherfucker was hard. That nigga sent out a whole bunch of disses too. Yeah. Oh God. <laughs> yeah. Put you down a killer. Hey, put you down to break somebody for real, like in the humblest way ever. That's why I full feel you. Yeah, say. Yeah. yeah. He's super P. Yeah, man. Say, man. Say, the game is it's wide open. Man, say, it's crazy right now because you got Kendrick Lamar, you got. Oh, I fuck, I fuck you with, got future. You I got fuck with me too. Drake, who Meek Mill? No, me. I'm number one. Oh, you? Oh, you number one? Yeah, I'm number oh, one shit. in my category. Oh, shit. You know okay, what I'm saying? all right, Spain, You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm number one in my category though, for sure. Okay, that's my okay. fifth one. Okay, okay. Shit, he said I'm number one in my category. Shit, number six is number one. No bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Nah, real nigga, shit. <laughs> no bullshit. I got some shit that's gonna come. I ain't, you know what I'm saying? Nah, for real. So, what about any features, man? Who you been looking to be working with? You know what I'm saying? Who you always want to uh, work with? Nah, Nizzle, a feature. Okay. Uh, you know what I'm saying? He finna, you know what I'm saying? Do it. He finna do his little turnaround. TG Comas. Some, oh, my nigga Slat. Okay. Slat Hard. Uh, Jug Glocks. Jug got something for sure. Um, who else? Uh, um, I'm gonna do a feature with my little brother Uno. I'm finna do a feature with Long. Oh, um, I don't know. I got a couple features. No, I don't got no more features for real. Man, who you always wanted to do a song with that you uh, ain't never, I uh, mean, who you always wanted to do a song with that's famous or, you know, that's in the uh, industry? Shit. For real. I don't care to do a song with none of them. You know okay, okay. I mean, they cool. Oh, shit. They, but, you know, you know, I rather... I believe in myself and I like my own music too. But nah, nah. What's nice said the same shit. Uh, uh big ass the plug. Yeah, the yeah. big ass the plug said the same yeah, shit. Yeah, cause I ain't, when I get in, like I got my mind shit. Like nigga, you can't go in. Like I ain't no dick riding that nigga. You right, know what I'm right. 
I got I like I'm used to stuff. But why it gotta be dick riding to do a song with somebody that you that you like admire? You know, what's wrong with another man admiring another man? Because I'm not finna for go. the, the work and the and, Bro, and the shit he I put mean, in. I'm just not finna go in there just all super just do but like happy to you know what I'm saying? Nah, I like, understand like, all like, that. I too, oh yeah, I understand that. Like not too, like groupie. Being that too big being that too big too, you gotta I gotta I gotta Make sure that you respect me too. You know what I'm saying? Nah, no, that that that's safe. Set that respect too. I feel you. I feel you. I feel you. But everywhere you go in the war zone, I know so. <laughs> I, know, I, I know that though. I know that though. But I'm just, just saying. Nah, that, for real. Know. Everywhere you go in the war zone, you know what I'm saying? Because you know it's like you got to go in there with your, you know, chin up, chin yeah, down. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Let a nigga know. Nah, man. for real. You know, I feel like, you. You, I feel you, you. You you big too, but you know what I'm saying? I got some. I'll bring some to the platform. Right, you know right, right. Because you know, with these famous people nowadays, they get so big headed. Just because they getting paid or because they getting views, you know what I'm saying? A lot of stuff don't even be with it, you know what I'm saying? It, yeah, be. Right. it go both like, ways. Like, I don't, like, I was talking to somebody, like, bro told me he liked my music. I ain't gonna say no, no. Yeah. Bro told me he liked my music. I say, appreciate it, bro. He say, send, he say, submit something. Uh, he say, submit something at $350. $350. I say, bro, what? He say send three hundred fifty dollars and I submit your and I'm gonna submit your song. I say, bro, I'm not sending you three hundred fifty dollars. He say, bro, this could be the chance of your life. He say, bro, do you know how famous I am? How rich I am? He start sending me pictures and when I was like, bro, are you a fucking goofy nigga? <laughs> the fuck is wrong with you, boy? Boy, I'm like, boy, that nigga, a nigga scam artist over there. He, bro, know, he, he know how to run it. You know what I'm saying? That's yeah, how it is. Yeah, he didn't even run shit. Yeah, I, I sent that nigga a picture of this. <laughs> I, I, I didn't say shit. Hell no. Nope. You know what I'm saying? For real. I mean, that's yeah, that's how it is. You got to watch out for them snakes out there. There's snakes out there, and then it's also real opportunities, just like uh. Now I had some real opportunities too. I right. be take, I be, I be taking in knowledge and shit like that. Right, right, right. I fuck with, fuck with me. Ah, really? Shit, you be on it. You be on the old, any old school music. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah. You 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 know you know any uh, old school G's that you know they used to rap and come up out of Dallas. Uh, no look. You don't know your history. You know some of your history from out here. No, I don't really be talking about the like the older people. I don't even get heard. Like they don't even get brought up to me for real. Why not? I mean, why not? You know what I'm saying? Like why not people like Pookies and Luchies and um, Bobo Luchianos or motherfucking me Tux because, or like. Look, Gator man's or look, I don't sit up here and uh -huh. reminisce about nobody. Cause if I sit up here and reminisce about somebody, shit, I got too much. My mind gotta worry about how to feed my my my, my family, how to be a man here, how to right. do all this. So I don't really care about no other nigga. You know what I'm saying? I just be trying to. I asked it. Move forward, and I can't worry about what bro did. He he old. He in the past. Okay, let me be bigger than him. His name did this standard. That's all yeah. I need to know for sure. Cool. But what I'm saying Stop. is, it's like this. Like you do music, right? Yes, sir. So, when you do music, it's also about leaving a legacy, right? Yeah. Right, right. So, when you leave your legacy, right, you want people to respect you, right? Facts. Right, facts, right? So, it's always about paying homage. So, like, if I, like, say, for instance, if, if I go out later on and I say, damn, you know, man, I looked up to that boy, 6'6", six, six was this, 6 was that, you know what I'm saying? I pay homage to this man because this man came from this and went to that, you know what I'm saying? No matter how long he did it, he yeah. did it. You feel what I'm saying? Yes. Like, and like when you in this, especially when you in this, we call rap, hip hop, whatever you want to call this, you know what I'm saying? You, you have to know where you come from and also know where you going. You also got to know where you going well, let me also, you know what I'm saying. Well, let me change it up then. Like, All right. well, when you pay homage, you can pay homage when it's due. I don't right. mean by like so right. much. Is, like, I mean so much. Like, don't worry about me too much. You know what I'm saying? I right. Because to, to be honest, I don't want nobody to worry about what I'm doing either. Right. You know what I'm saying? Honestly, you supposed to top me and be better than me. You know what I'm saying? Right, I right, right. Everybody, everybody expectations is how we are. All human beings, right, human right. beings in my eyes. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. I don't treat them no different because guess what? Everybody go through everyday shit. Facts, facts, you know what facts, facts, facts. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody gonna tap you on the, you know what I'm saying? You gonna have some people that's gonna tap you on your shoulder and pat you and shit, but mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? This shit is a little different for everybody. Nah, facts, 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 facts. It's always, it's always that, you know what I'm saying? But it's just like, too, when you move and then when you trying to get to that top, especially with your music, you'll realize, like, it's yeah. still a lot of those old niggas that ones be sitting right there at that, at that door for you to be able to, 
Yeah, I still, I'm, right, right. I'm you feel what I'm saying? Somebody. I'm a still respect yeah, yeah. somebody too, just like when I see my own. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. I'm, I'm, I'm still, uh, you know what I'm saying? Nah, for real shit. I ain't never disrespect for right. I still say yes, sir, no, sir. You know what I'm saying? Like, but I understand too, when you don't know somebody, when you get there, you'll get to see or meet. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. I, nigga, I know exactly where you're coming from on that. So, much respect. So, like, right now, you know, like, I always do people like this, you know what I'm saying? Because we're going to turn up in this motherfucker because, man, I was talking about getting a freestyle out of you, you know what I'm saying, before I get... Wait, 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 and before I even do that, though, before I even do that, though, you know what I'm saying, I got to ask this question because I always ask this question, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you, if you, if you was in my shoes, what question would you ask yourself that I didn't ask you tonight? Uh, what's uh, <laughs> uh, shit? Why did you call yourself Stay On Game? Okay, and I and I got a, and I got a more. I got another question too. So, what will be? Wh why do you call yourself Stay Down Game? And where did the name Six come from? All right, so look, so we are so everybody earned their numbers in that game. You know what I'm saying? We got. You know what I'm saying? I ain't even gonna say the name, but everybody earned earned their numbers. You know what I'm saying? I got the name six. You know what I'm saying? I used to always be like touchdown. You know what I'm saying? I'm right. Shit. You know what I'm saying? You know when you just go to touchdown, you, you get six on the board. Right. <laughs> oh shit. We got to stay down game. Okay. Really, my, uh, my little brother and those. You know what I'm saying? They all came with us like, nigga, we staying down for the summer. Nigga, you know what I'm saying? We're going to get a pop in the winter. Like, right. You know what I'm saying? They used to always say this shit even when they was little. Like, right. I done seen them come up little saying this shit since fifth grade. So, shit, we just merged that shit. We were like, fuck, fuck it, shit. We merging it. And then we started cutting my finger. I like shit. I started cutting my finger. I'm like, nigga, shit. This shit locked in, nigga. Stay down okay. game. Stay down game. No okay. Bullshit. Nigga say, nigga, stay down game. I ain't stay down game, but that's just y'all niggas out there. <laughs> no bullshit, you got to Nah, fuck it, shit. I'm going, but I'm going to stay down, goddamn it. <laughs> nah, for real. Ain't nothing wrong with it, nigga. 30 days staying down and stay you 30 years of your life. All right. Man, what is like, man? Like, what is like growing up in the Grove? Like, what, what was it like for you? You know what I'm saying? Look, look. What was it like? It was really cool. It was really cool just being over there. I was fucking with my nigga BB too. Oh my god, free my nigga Double B. Shit, we just just always be thugging, running around and hoe. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's right. a lot of shit that just be going on. Right. You know what I'm saying? Ain't too much to be said. Just be too much shit going on. Like, what's the day in the life in the Grove? Cause it's like, I know a lot of niggas. I know when we used to come to the Grove every time. See, they, like back then, the stove. like back then, you used to be like a lot of fighting. You know what I'm saying? Right. You just gonna go up there and fight. You know what I'm saying? You're going to see somebody you don't like right. at the train station, the gas station, some <laughs> shit like that. Shit, fuck it. Fight. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That shit escalate, shit escalate. You know what I'm saying? Right. That is really how that shit be going. Nah, you know what the spot said now in the Grove? Like, nigga, they, they got any clubs back open? You know what I'm saying? I don't think they got I, shit over there open. They changed that bitch to Fiesta, some other shit over there. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I ain't been over there in so motherfucking long, nigga. Yeah. Look, I really moved. I really moved. Look, I was over there. I stayed in Sigaville. You know what, mm -hmm. what I'm saying? I stayed, yeah, I over stayed there in, by the feds. No uh, bullshit. Mm -hmm. I stayed in Sigaville. I went to Sigaville Middle School with, with a lot of niggas. You know what I'm saying? Right. Too. You know what I'm saying? So I used to be over there between, between Sigaville, Pleasant Grove. Right. That ain't Sigaville, far. Pleasant Grove. Yeah. That shit 11 minutes, nigga. What yeah, the fuck? that shit ain't far. <laughs> right yeah, there. Yeah, shit. <laughs> no and, bullshit. And then it's, well, it's like a little whole black town right <laughs> no. there. To, oh, my mama. Yeah. And that shit was simple as fuck. Then mm -hmm. we, we could walk to that hoe. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Simply. So shit, you know. Shit, nigga used to be fighting every day too. Used to be beating shit up. No bullshit. I used to always hang around just all the older niggas. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? That's where you get the game from. No bullshit. Niggas scratch harder than no bitch. Oh yeah. Shit, you gonna learn something. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, always, man. always. You cannot, you cannot be pushed. They're gonna always say, hey look, bro, jump out there. Like they was just always calling me too. Nigga, you know what I'm saying? I was like, shit, fuck, come on. We gonna scratch, nigga, no curve. Nah, I'm square business, nigga. Now we finna get ready to scratch right now. We finna turn up, you know what I'm saying? We finna go down like this. And... Yeah. Star mm. It's going down. <laughs> Why the fuck you run up? Uh, 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 uh.
uh, why the fuck you running? Uh, uh, why the fuck this nigga running? I got to dump him. Uh, uh, I hit his face, I hit his chest, this nigga clumsy. Uh, I get the back, bro, with the sack, and I don't fumble. Uh, uh, we hit his face, why the fuck a nigga mumble? Uh, uh, give me that. Hit his chin and watch him tumble. Uh uh. Brrr, switch your channel, make a rumble. Hold on, fuck up, nigga, stumble. Hold on, yeah, we had him running. Hold on, yeah, get that money. Hold, yeah. <laughs> Hold on, yeah, I get that money. Through the hundreds, I be thumbing. Bad bitch hit from the back. Hit the goods, I gotta run it. Hold on, yeah, she like holla six. I be getting. <laughs> Hold on, yes he like holly six. I be getting to it, uh, run up on the six. Don't mad nigga, boy, you stupid. Uh, I done popped this perk up in this bitch and I'm, uh, I done popped this perk up in this bitch and I'm slow. All my niggas crash, they get on ass and they on go. Yeah. We gon' hit his face, take off his top and watch his throat. Uh, Twitchy hit his face and watch his neck hit on flow. Uh, 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 I just six, uh, nigga, uh, uh. Yeah, my boy Six on this motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? It's going down, you know what I'm saying? Lit podcast, you know how we do it, you know what I'm saying? Before we get up out of here, man, you got any shout outs, you know what I'm saying? Oh, like, shit. what's going down, man? Let people know, let people know where they can reach you at and everything shit, like that. Shit, only one stay down, shit, Instagram, only one stay down. Shit, shout out Uno, shout out Dogs, you know what I'm saying? Shout out my gang, shout out Long Duke Black. Shout out you for having me on your show. You one know time, one time. That bullshit, long the 10th. It's dropping. It's coming. You already oh, yeah. heard that. Yeah. EP on the way to June 16th. No bullshit. <laughs> there we go. That. Only one stay there. Promote that shit, no my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Hey, June 16th hey. gonna have some hot shit. Yeah, it's coming. Hey, I'm trying hey. to tell you. Oh, hey, hey, where you high to? Go get that shit too. <laughs> that shit high as fuck. Pip squeak. All that shit high. Go, to, go log into my Instagram. See, my YouTube, six official music page. Stay down six. Oh, yeah, two Fs too. You know what I'm saying? Two Fs entertainment. E and T go, let's do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, 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 all right, we about this bitch. You know how we, we do it. And we about this bitch. I walk the block up to my feet, hurt the slayer, yeah. Better 